Hey, what's up guys? So today I will be decorating this really cute chalkboard easel. It's double-sided. And I got this from Hobby Lobby. I'm going to use these really cute flowers. These I purchased at Michael's. It's a really cute blush color and then this is just a bouquet. also have some baby's breath that I want to use. To write the words, I'm going to use really cute letter stencils and this really cute font. And a chalk marker to write with. Also, I have wire cutters, scissors, and a hot glue gun. Let's get started. Alright, so here's the board. And I've already started picking out the stencil letters that I need. So, I have S, I, P. E. We need two R's and an A. So, I'm just going to one at a time trace over the letters writing her name here and I'll write her fiance's name underneath and then their wedding date. So I want to go ahead and use the chalk marker and get started. I'm just going to go ahead and place the stencil letters where I want them. So this is how the S looks and then once I trace over it I'm just going to fill in any spots or do any touch-ups that need to be done. So I have their names and date on the front and then I'm just going to put happily ever after on the back. So next thing I'm going to do is cut the stem on the flowers just to make them shorter. All right, so the way that I think it's the easiest to glue it down, see I have the stems cut. I'm just going to put hot glue all around here and then stick it in the center against the board. And be very generous with that hot glue. And you just stick it against the board and hold it for a few seconds. And I'm just going to do this with all of the flowers, hot glue them, and press them against the rim of the board. So try to make sure your stems are pretty short so that they're not sticking up too high. Alright, so this first one is glued down. Then don't forget you have your leaves and your baby's breath. So I'm actually going to glue the baby's breath on top of these leaves right here then glue them beside the flower I'll show you guys how that looks alright so I glued the baby's breath to a couple of leaves and I'm just gonna glue this right beside this flower going to press it against one of the leaves just to make sure it's nice and sturdy so that's how it looks I'm just going to take the pink flower and come right beside it and keep going this is how it looks so far So this is what it looks like when everything is complete. There's the top right with the baby's breath and the leaves, have their names and the date. 